Well, hello there. It seems like I'm back every year, and every year um, the garden is filled with different surprises. Every year something goes well, something doesn't go that well, but you never know what's going to be there and what's going to come out. Um, I know for our auction, uh, some of the items that have come down from the garden through our kitchen and then out by U.S. mail uh, are some of these things that grew at the mountain and uh, therefore I like to say they have mountain sunshine, they have mountain rain, they have mountain air, and they have mountain soil all together in this one place. So this year uh, some of the things that we have oh, that came out well is uh, a salsa and the salsa is from our tomatoes, our hot peppers, our garlic, our onions, and our cilantro. And so that came out really good this year. And this year, we managed to get to the blueberries before the birds did, and there's some blueberry jam coming in um, for a landing. And Brother Joe has a quince bush in front of his house. Now, quince is something that not a lot of people know about, it's an old-fashioned kind of fruit, but it tastes very, very fine when you have it in a jelly. And this is quince and apple jelly, so that's coming. Um, bread and butter pickles, uh, always um, popular. Cucumbers from the garden and uh, onions from the garden. Zucchini relish. Now, sometimes people joke about how do we get rid of all the extra zucchini? No, um, the answer is zucchini relish because this particular recipe that we have has a zucchini, as we said, maybe other kinds of um, squash, some really nice uh, carrots that are in here and some peppers as well. And this one, many, many people swear by. So get out uh, your, your old cookbooks or get online and if you have extra zucchini next year, make some zucchini relish. This one I can't, we can't keep in stock, so to speak. Dilly beans. Now, um, the beans are here, or all from the garden, the garlic that's in here, the dill that's in here, and the, the hot peppers. So uh, again, uh, this year I planted three beds of beans because there was been such a demand for the dilly beans. And this year they've, they've come through for us. Now this, I can honestly say, the hot pepper jelly is the favorite of our Bonaventure cross-country team. Now, they, they uh, came and visited right before school started, and I said, you guys, though, you have to buy some cream cheese, and I'll supply the rest. And they did, and they were scarfing it down. And I don't think it was only because they're athletes and they're always hungry. I think they really enjoyed it. So, uh, when you come to the auction, this is some of what's happening. So, uh, uh, the uh, cost of um, canning and everything is always offset by what people are able to give at the auction. So, um, please uh, bid well and uh, maybe even come by another time to the mountain and there might be a can or two left.